Right, welcome to the stream. If you can see, the lights are flashing in the reflection of the window there. Very good. Right, today's mission, and it is a bit of a mission. We're doing a bit of everything. Um, We've gone for a soldier, and basically what it is, um, one of the British soldiers, who's also known as a mod, came over to here with his regiment, and um, he went missing. So we have to get to the army barracks where he's supposed to be posted and we have to get some information. And being CID that I am, whoop, whoop, we have to investigate the case. So off we go. And we will start by getting petrol, because we always do. So Gary Shale, big shout to you in the stream because this is dedicated to you, man. DCI Greg Quig uh, Quigley, Glenn Quigley, he's also there. And Chief Super is uh, Tony Stamp, so it's going to be a bit of a, a bit of a thing. So we're going to get out on the road by getting petrol. And remember, we're not patrolling. We're not pulling over anyone traffic stops unless we really have to. Uh, it's sunset at the moment, so it's about 5.30. 7.42 to speak. So it's gone... It's gone a bit like Pete Tong. Actually, I want to go to dusk and I want to change the weather to like foggy or something. Here we go. I'm going to get some petrol. You never know where we're going to find ourselves. We normally find ourselves, in fact, going to the barracks every day. Ouch, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. She's like, change this as well. No, not that. Right, okay. Does that actually change it to the... Right, okay. Right, I've got petrol. It didn't really look like we got petrol actually. Should we get petrol properly now? We are just messing around. We didn't really get petrol. Oh, get a cable wrapped up in your feet. So yeah, today's stream is basically look, looking for a missing soldier called Gary Shale. He's also known as Spider. Uh, the shit house. Well, they don't call him the shit house. That's um, damages word for him. Oh, I'll just leave the, the thing on the floor there. All right, so we are going to head all the way over here but I'm thinking there's a flight coming in from Sandy Shores in about 45 minutes if I get to Sandy Shores airfield and get ready I can get a flight over to um... oh no I just remember that's not we're gonna have to go and get Indian 99 maybe I don't know maybe not there is a flight coming in though but it's it's not really a, a military flight. Oh, there is a military. Um, Mackenzie Airfield is hired by the... Oh! So, yeah, Mackenzie Airfield is hired by... Um, hired by... Sorry. Bollocks. It's hired by the military as well. They do some stuff over there. So we'll get a little flight from there. Over to the... Oh! over to the I mean I don't know why we don't just drive over to be honest yeah let's drive over it makes more sense fuck flying don't need the map really on the screen is he gonna go left here right so yeah we'll just put that here when was the last time I did that oh he looks like he's hunched over the steering wheel the way that view is so we're gonna have a big search on at some point, right, we've um, nailed the guys at the um, liquor race store as well. I can't believe I'm actually just cruising normal. And we've got an observation to set up around. Actually, do you know what? We'll go past Stab City on the way. Oh. Oh, you idiot. I, I, I was going to put the handbrake on, but do you know what? I'm just alright. Oh, here he is. Oh, he's more on that side, so... I've got a roadblock going there. I'm going to stand at this side of him, because I don't want him to, you know, die anymore. He's already dead, the poor coyote. So, um, 23... Uh, yeah, sorry, gold to Sierra Oscar. We've got a uh, dead coyote on there. Joshua, I've just been run over by someone, right? And I'm about to get someone here. Get the fuck out of the car. Fuck. 
Get out of the car. CID, get out of the car. Taser deployed. You see the lights on? Obviously nobody's home. Stay down. Right, anyway. Damage to our car again. We have to clear the scene here. That's total crap. Total bullshit. Unfreeze time. Oh! I didn't know you could freeze the time. Okay. We're going to freeze the time then for a bit. I didn't know you could do that. So that means it's going to be night time for longer. So I wonder why it was always night time for longer. Hold on a minute. Well, I need to... What did I do to unfreeze time? What did I fucking do? There you go, yeah. Unfreeze time. So, time's frozen, so it'll stay like that for longer. That's quite good. Alright, nice. Okay, so we're going to get in our, our car again. Wait for another version of it. Right, now... We're going to... I think we're going the wrong way here. Right, yeah, nothing happened. Everything's fine. I just realised that I could freeze time. I really didn't know that. That's amazing. Look at that. So, it's time will go normal, but if I freeze it, it will stay like this for ages. So, that's cool. I didn't even know you could do that. It makes it even better. Right, back into roleplay mode again. Yeah, gold to Sierra Oscar. We're clear on that scene. We're now um, going to be passing Stab City in about two minutes. Just so we can see about this observation point as well. Freezing time, that's really good. I mean, how long have we been able to do that? Maybe the whole time, I just haven't noticed. And our next observation point onto Stab City will be on the two water towers. I don't know what they're swearing about. Sorry. Everything alright? Okay. No problem. We're free to go. I don't know what they were swearing about. What damage have I done to my car? I'm no damage. Right, yeah, let's get on with the stream. It's gone a bit funny so far. Right, and we want to get out on the highway, really. I should have gone down the other way. This is all like dirt roads. Right, here's our next observation point up here. Oh, not that high up. What's how is there? When it's sunny, we want to get out. Well, we don't want to be up there. But we will eventually go in there. See what's going on. We've got uh, one of our snouts down here on the beach. We're going to find out if he knows anything. Good thing nobody will be able to tell who we are. Are they down there? Cars there. I'm gonna have to go down and have a look. He'll know it's me straight. He'll be like, "What are you doing down here, man? Right, nothing. Just come see how you did. Any information? I knew you was gonna do. It. Got any money? Yeah, right. Where are they? Sleep. I believe Jimmy's in here. Oh, Quadrophenia, and Jimmy. You know? Oi, Jim. Yeah, what's up, mate? How you doing? Oi, Jim, have you seen Spider? Nah, I heard he went missing, didn't he? Yeah, he definitely didn't get on the 515, mate. And he went out of his brain, but um, I'm going to my way to the um, barracks to see where he's at. We'll find out. Can, do you know anything? Well, I don't know. I did a couple of underwater farts with my mate in the baths, you know? I'm a mod, you see. Oh, I know you're a mod, but th the point is we're trying to find your mate. And he's a mod as well. Spider's a shit ass, but we'll find him. Indeed, we will. All right, I'm about to get on anyway, man. See you later, on, Jim. See you later, mate. We are the mods. We are the mods. We are the. We are the. We are the mods. Oh, Jimmy's on one. I wonder if he's got that bird in that tent with him. I don't know what to do. Poor Gary. We'll find him.
Alright, so now we're gonna get onto the um We're gonna get onto where we was going before. I don't know why he's not there, so We freeze time and then unfreeze it a little bit. I mean otherwise we can just keep turning it back and I don't want really to keep spawning it back, so do you know what? What time is it in game? Yeah, let's freeze it right now because even when we're at fucking three o'clock in the game, we can do these tests, we can do experiments for Easter eggs even better now we can freeze. And I've gone the complete wrong way, I'm well not the wrong way, the long way. I'm gonna we was going to go to Mackenzie Airfield, but it's too foggy for me to even bother flying, I can't be asked. Are we going to go this side? No, we're going to go across the bridge. No, we're going to go this way for a change. Well, I'm driving one-handed here, so I really want to black out the lights and not cause tension. I'd rather be seen and not heard, or I'd rather be just none. <laughs> so, I just discovered that I could freeze time on here. Now, you guys might have known that before, but now I've just found it out, it's going to make my streams a whole lot easier. When we do a night shift, we do a night shift. When we do a day shift, we do it there. That's pretty good, though. All time. Oh. Maybe it will shift. Maybe it just goes slower. Driving slow. It's to play Forza Horizon 4 again. Uh, 5 again. Oh, there's that mountain line. He must have done some glitchy shit. Yeah, see, it's stuck on 1231 now. That's good. Oh, there's a white thing there. But hold on a minute. I just want to... Oh, I just missed him then. Oh, sorry. Gone, you're alright. Um... Fuck the car being like that. What did I just hear in my headphones then? I just heard something in my headphones. I just heard something humming in my headphones. Like it was someone around me humming. Go ahead, Sierra Oscar. Can I report at. Oh, okay, so I have to report at Palio, pick up my helicopter, and then go down to the barracks. Okay. That's fine. If time's still frozen, we're gonna change it a little bit, yeah. I'm really surprised at that, I just heard something. That was a good screenshot, I shouldn't have moved the camera though, but I'm really shocked what I just heard then. What minute would that be? 13, 12 minutes? That's really a good shot as well with the left hand side of the map. You see the backgrounds. Yeah, I just I just heard something really weird. I just heard a humming like a hmm 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 hmm. Now forget that. We're gonna get back on the road here. Yeah. I remember my six by six I have in story mode when I used to ride it. Used to use tre Trevor a lot in this. So if you use Trevor a lot in this area at this time and not all oh, three o'clock at night in the fog, apparently you're supposed to see some different stuff. I still haven't explored it yet, but oh, sometimes you hear noises and you can't explain what's that over there. It's just a crack in the rock, crack in the rock, and a jack in the box. You don't need four beams.
again we we're, we're gonna actually drive slow up this area because this is one of um spiders sergeant major spiders favorite spots he likes this area and we always used to come down here and make music me and spider and this way we right bring his scooter mates around him and they used to get getting problems on their scooter in the dirt this is a place where spider would get like stuck um there's a spot up here where the rockers came and beat him up when he was with his missus and they done him the second time they did him and the bloke said we don't do nothing for nothing I remember his exact words and he went and he said mate went which one's the bird and which one's the bloke he said I to tell you lot come here darling give us a kiss yeah so I heard a humming sound that was really weird that was like a ghostly sound but actually like I don't want, like I said, I don't want to attract attention because if anything's going on, like dogging, I can, I can soon spot people and each other one. <laughs> uh, watch out for the mild, mighty bush as well. With some acceleration. This is some, yeah. I remember coming up here the first time when I got, well, first time, yeah, about the first time when I was online. I think I was level 18 and I heard all Bigfoot bending trees down there. I'm just so happy that I just know how to freeze time. That's good. Bang on 12 o'clock now. Ah, oh, sick. I'm going to sit back a little bit and just try and enjoy this stream here. So, are we going back round again? No, we're not. Here we go. What we're going to do is we're going to get out and have a quick look around. Again, I was about to put my blues on then, but... What we got? That's non-lethal. Got that for light. Advanced that would do for that um, I'm thinking of just keeping smoke just for now but for now I'm going to be rolling with this so if anything does come around <laughs> it's going to come around now right foggy remember we still got to get some um, palito bait or divert ourselves go to the uh, north and then go back south again down that side of the map so what are we trying to do here Be a prick. Right now, what I want to try and do is um, unfreeze time till about 3 o'clock. So, yeah, around about 3 a.m., I want to freeze time. And then we're going to really test the waters on our way. So, very nice. Places like this, when you're Trevor, you have to keep looking across the rock tops. I can hear them weird noises, you don't even understand. Like if you've got headphones, I suggest you probably put the headphones in and listen, because I can hear all that dump, 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 and humming and stuff, and it's really not something I've heard in game before. I might change the weather. Do I change the weather or not? Um, no, I'm going to keep it foggy because it's supposed to be kind of. It should be like fog. I'm not going to keep my phone out. But. Slowly do it, slowly do it. Whoa. Who's on the stampers? Shout out to the stampers. Oh, Harold, how are you, man? Ninja, may the father of understanding guide you every day, sir. I keep forgetting Bomber Clark. I keep forgetting what the handbrake is on this car. What damage have I done? I don't see no damage unless my bumper's hanging off. <clears throat> it's bound to happen when the road's like this. Gets Polito. It'll be about four. Well, what's that? That's the the car that comes off the. Whoa! What the fuck is this? Well, we're definitely getting out. Um, we're just gonna switch to a pistol at the moment. And you know what? We're gonna keep it quiet. Said I didn't want to. Mention. What's this then? I've never noticed this before. The skulls down there or something. It was like skulls and shit. I can make faces out of them. So 
What system? Is this a DeLorean or something? There's no bodies in the car or nothing. Maybe it's just a burnt out car that I've never noticed before. Magic mushroom? No, it ain't. I know he gets in the wrong fucking. Right, okay, what's the time? Two o'clock approach. So we're gonna get onto the a little bit now. Hopefully, it's quick as we a bit. Nothing come through on the radio about um, anything. No updates on Spider. Oh, Mountain Lion. We'll know more when we get to Polito. Oh, no. See, when we get to Fort Zanku, though, to be precise, we'll know a lot more, at least. We're just going on what so far. Oh, we know We know he's... he's. Well, if we know, he's definitely alive. Oh, that's the phone again. Who's still... Actually, do you know what I want to do? I just want to go and see if, um, what's his name's inside his thing here. Oh, it's Cyril. Hello. How you doing, man? I'm alright. You know there's a mod run going on down Polito, um, down Vespucci next, next week. Yeah, I know I'm going, man. Spider gonna be there? Um, yeah, he'll be there, man. He'll be there. It's not gotta go, man. What you been up to? Ah, uh, nothing, man. Just doing my shit. Oh, not literally, I hope. No, not literally. Catch you later. Shit, I can't tell him. I'm not allowed to tell anyone about Spider. It's a to no basis and he just don't need to know. 220. Let's get close to the screen. We'll just have a nice calm stream anyway for now, just, just to kick off the introduction for Gary Shale. I'm going to keep our eyes on that phone, so by the time we get to the barracks, it'll be more or less... Yeah, when we get to the barracks, it'll be more or less part two approaching. Because I'm getting tired as well. I don't want to play fours though, I just want to do my little. Actually, I'm going to let time roll out. Any other stream will do that. I mean, no. No, don't mind me. I'm just thinking out loud. When he gets to... Oh, well, can I move him off the road, like... Right, we want to um, freeze time now. Right, hold on, we got to clear up the scene here. I know it's going to go back to 12 o'clock, so yeah, scene cleared up. Thank you guys, cheers for being patient. Right, now we're going to report to Polito base station. Never been here before. No, I have. I've been here a long time ago. I ain't been here, though. It's a long time I haven't. So we're going to hopefully get into Indian 9-9. Oh, they said to go around the back. Everything should be set up. So what we'll do, we'll just wait for our pilot to bring our um, helicopter in. Hey, oh, not bad parking, actually. Are we going in Indian 9-9? That'll be the Swift. I don't know. But, oh, here it is. And we're in. Up. We're off gear up. Are we going to use them lights actually? Are we going to head down to Fort Zancudo? But what we're going to do is we're going to get some altitude. We're going to do like proper helicopters to come up a little bit further this time. And we're just going to follow the coastline around to the left. Try and stay low enough so we can see where we're going. Because I hate landings, especially in planes now. If I had a plane, I'd be fucked. Leo Triangle, oh my god. Film coming up too high, so we're just going to be using the radar here, just like proper pilots. Altitude is 1000 and climbing. We 
Yeah, that's a good level. It's fine. I'm gonna go out wide a little bit. Bit of turbulence like up here. 301. I wish it wasn't like freeze time, but it would make time go slower. That would be interesting. You see the runway just coming up on our left end. I'm gonna go approach it on the left. And turn to our left here and then we're gonna go back round and get on the helipad down there hopefully. Oh well, no, we're gonna use the hangar here. What's that underneath us there then? That's one of them. There's him taking off. Oh, he's off already. There should be another one. Right, where are we going to go? We're going to. Are we going to our hangar down the bottom there? So we're going to bring our gear down. Well, who are we looking for exactly? We're going to have to find a way in. Uh, a way to fly into our hangar. But we own the hangar and then the little open bit in front of it where I'm going to fly above. So I might actually just use this if there's nothing under it for the helicopter. But for now, we're going to. There's a tank down there as well. We're going to get in our hangar. We'll go to the hangar and then possibly, I don't know if we're going to get a car delivered, but we're going to speak to the guy in the tank, see what he says, and then. He's the guy that we're coming to see. We might actually fly back down to um, Polito again, actually. Drop off the Indian 99. We won't catch him before he goes. Ah, there he is. What's up, dude? Yo, what's up, man? Hey, what's up? What happened to your voice? Nothing. He's drunk. I can tell. Yeah, anyway, listen, we're Spider. I don't know, man. It's sad, the shit that's going on, but we know Spider, he's fine, man. He's a right motherfucking shithouse, but he's fine. He's Metal Mickey, and he's done, and he takes it up the... Oh, no. No, no. Anyway. I know, right? So, can you give me any information? What was he wearing the last time? Hey, you dumb. Look what we're wearing, fool. All right, well, listen, I've got to take this information back to the... Shut up, I'm talking. I've got to take this information back to Polito Bay. Don't nod when I'm talking to you. All right, anyway, boys, you've done nothing yeah. but give me shit, so I'll catch you later. Yeah, later, man. Good to see you again. Not as good to see you, though, boys. Do you know what I feel like doing? Getting in that tank and just blowing them out of the way. It'd be so easy to do as well. All right, so we're going to get back into our helicopter. No information there. We're going to get back to Polito Bay. Not Polito Bay. Yeah. Polito Bay. And now, the whole night has gone sort of um, very quick sort of thing. We are going to be heading back to Polito Bay now. Yeah, picking up our car. <clears throat> Hover taxi and gear up. Get back to our car and then we're... Um, Find out our next move. Yeah, this is gold one go this is gold go ahead. Last spotted where? Okay. Roger that. Yeah, I'll be careful how I share the information. Oh, there's a bird. Well, we just had news that he's been spotted at Vespucci Beach in a part in a bar. So we're gonna have a unit go down to make sure he's alright. And we're going to get out of here. So, Gary Shell, aka Sergeant Major Spider, as well. So, we're going to get back to um, Polito Bay, drop this off, get in our car, pick up our car that we got, that we left, and then we're going to go back to. If we're going to Sandy Shores again, where are we going to. We could just stay up here, wherever we. No, we're just going to go back to Sandy Shores. 
This is our route. Anytime we come up here, we're just going to use this route here. There's always something about this area that makes me think like... Like that. Oh. Sorry, it wasn't a spooky beach. It was this beach. So he got their wires crossed. He weren't drinking in the bar. He was seen on an island. Okay, so this might be the island. So he's going to know that we're coming around. I wonder if he's just like trying to run away from us or he's just trying to tell us that he needs help. Radio coming through, doesn't it? Yeah, go ahead. It's me, Spider. S spider? Yeah, it's me. Fucking shit ass Spider. I'm in this island. Can you come down and get me? I don't want to get off the island, mate. I've got a house here. Right, I'm going to land, Spider. It's me, man, Joe Chris. Alright, come down. But I'm not going to show my face. Okay, so, Spider, go into a different channel. Alright, mate. I'm a mod, you see. Look, it's Spider's boat down here. He's crafty. Survival of the fittest, eh? Right, where are we parking? There? Where are we landing this? We're going to land it just, just over on a flatter surface here. So Spider's just been living here the whole time. And he ain't gone out while. We're going to find out why we have to find him. I'm sure we're going to find out why right now. I shouldn't have had them lights on. People are going to know. Don't come any closer. Why is that, Spider? Listen, I'm undercover. Because I'm a mod, you see. There's going to be a big riot going down at Vespucci Beach next week, you see. Right? We're going to kick the shit out of all the rockers. The, the ones that are from California, anyway. Listen, Spider, do me a favour. I won't say nothing, but... Do people know you're here? Yeah, but I'm underneath to know bases, and you don't need to know, you shit ass. All right, Spider. Don't come any closer. All right, man. All right, I'm going to get out of here. So, what's the time of this um, big gang thing? It's 4.30 in the afternoon till 12 at night, but they're going to kick off at about 1 o'clock in the night. All right, Spider, why do you sound different? I don't know. Do you like my new yard? Yep. Metal Mickey's in here as well. All right, Spider, I'm out of here, man. All right, later. Remember, we are the mods. Never forget. CCID mods outfit. I heard that. <laughs> so this is where Spider's been plotting up. He went missing, so it's a decoy, basically. We're gonna take off without lights, bring gear up, and we're gonna get off to turn off to the left, and we're gonna make way to Polito Bay. I like how Spider's done that. Got his own boat as well. Look. What are we gonna? gonna come in for a land at Palito B and then we shall report back to who needs to know about what which I think is back in Sandy what was the plan we were going back to Sandy again I feel like taking my beach plane back there right yeah and then when we come in for the land we're gonna come in the way that we took off like So we know Spider was safe from when we got his radio frequency. So we are happy. There's another thing I want to do, this little bit of island down here. There's a dog that normally goes around there and it disappears, so I want to show you that one day. Right, we're going to bring the gear down as we do this turn here. Right, turn the, uh, well, I say landing lights. Maybe we can come another path in, but this is probably quite a good uh, entrance, actually. Somewhat over the roof. I hear weird noises again. Look at the lights on them propellers. Like a reflection of light. I can hear another noise. Like It sounds like an owl. Maybe it's owls or something. Look at that for a landing. Oh yeah, that's better. Hold on, I need to get back in. I've forgotten something. Oh, 
I ain't bothering you, please, but give me my car back, man. Fuck, now I've got to take my fucking crash helmet off. And I've got no glasses again. I better lose the glasses. Get my helmet off. Urgh, get off. Thank fuck for that. Right, I've still got my glasses. Right. So we're not going to report anything to this station because we're not supposed to. I'm the orderer. I give the orders. The orderer. Right, here we go. So where are we going? Are we going back to Sandy or not? Let's just work out what we're going to do here quickly. We need to work out what we're going to do on our please locator. Alright. We need to get back to Sandy. That's the main thing, really. And then we'll call it a stream ending thing. Where the stream will end. So here we go. Back to Sandy. What way are we going? We're going to go back down the... GOH, but we're gonna go left this time, so we're gonna end up going heading north and heading round. Oh, green light! I didn't even need to do that. I don't never ever notice that the ammunition is um, ammunition is camouflage colour. Don't need to get petrol again. We got that already. We'll get back onto patrolling soon. Do you know what? I ain't even worried about that. I changed again. I'm hitting all the green lights. So yeah. All that being done. That's pretty much say we've gone for a soldier. What is he doing this guy? He's gonna have to stop in the road. I just want him to stop. That's it. Like the rest of them can stop. But he has to stop because he's pissed me off. So yeah, we know Spider's not missing anymore. We've just learned that he's on an undercover mission and he didn't want to be compromised. So that lorry just spawned in. I'm going to take your route. But I never really checked that place out. There's another place I need to check out that I keep missing. We'll get back to base now. Back to the factory and um, call it a day or a night or whatever it is. Did I freeze time again? No. It's lorry. Crazy shit. Oh. Good job I ducked out of the way then. Oh look, he's driving like a prick. I am as well, but... Oh look, his boss's name. Sorry about making him stop. Look, at least the lorry got away. That's um, Paul that was. Highway Patrol. Oh man, Paul, that was Gary. He's a sergeant now, by the way. Forgot to tell you about Gary. He became sergeant. He hasn't gone up in the world since. But he said he's comfortable as a sergeant. All them flashing lights are making my eyes go funny. And when I play Forza again, I'm definitely playing in my new car, driving my new car. Through. Oh shit, no, I'm not. I'm just gonna change the into it. Oh, hold on, I've got a message come through on the computer here that needs to be checked out, so I'm gonna pull off to the side a little bit. Here. Bear with me a minute. Right, okay, back to what I was doing, right, we just had a message on our uh, radio, or on our police device, or whatever you want to call it, nothing important, we just got to get back to Sandy Shores, that's it, clocking off, is there any point in me overtaking them here, 
Yeah, there is a little bit. Who's going to cut out into this lane? Have we gone past the um, thingy yet? Yeah, but well, here we go. A nice little drive, actually. We see the update this director mode a little bit more, put something else in it, like add some more stuff. Thank you. We're not even going to look behind us, we're just going to like role play that they just pulled over out of the way. Oh, I need to visit someone on the way back, by the way. What's that track in front? That's one of them. That's one of them guys who lives in Seb City. Alright, we need to go and see someone. Hey DCI, hey DCI Phillips, DCI Quigley, oh what the fuck, what's the state of this house? This is um, Detective Sergeant Trevor Phillips, his yard, apparently Quigley was staying here but he left, he didn't want to stay because of the state of the house, can you blame him? Quigley's not a dirty man, Trevor is, DS Phillips is like a, um, I don't know, no one to compare him with. Yeah, that's disgusting. Let me lock his door because he's. There you go, lock the door now. Boom. I said I locked the door. It's still moving. It's crazy how it just still moves when you move away from it. It's crazy. Alright, so DCI, Phil uh, sorry, Detective Sergeant Trevor Phillips, he's not about. So I'm guessing he's on part of that mission with um, Spider. And we will be back, well, I say back in uniform, we'll be in a uniform again soon. He's just keeping a low profile at the moment. And Jeff Farviano, his mama John's, he's um, Deputy Farviano, he owns that pizza shop there as well. And he's responsible for mobile repair kits, so if any of you need a mobile repair kit, there you go. I only leave the lights on because I'm not going to be here long. Oh, the lights just went off, but nobody's home. Anyway, I'm gonna get back in and update the um, the officer here, um, Chief um, Superintendent it's Tony Stamp. I'm gonna update him on everything back in the factory. And yes, people, salute and Gary Shell, big shout out to you, mate, because this one is your introduction to my content. So, peace out, you shit house.